Hey guys, what's up? It's Seven Seven. Welcome back to DDSS. Myself and the Ice Queen. Hi. <laughs> Pick it up along. Actually, pop top in it, shall we? Yes. Oh Jesus! <laughs> Did you kill the ram? No, but he gives you he gives you a trophy. Oh, you need a trophy. Oh, Jesus. Ah. <laughs> I think I prefer the Ice Queen better. Yeah. <laughs> uh, good lord. Okay, well, I did some things. Oh, not oh. much of a thing, but I, I, I did some fell building. in the hole. Okay. Yeah, I know this is building over here. Yeah, so. Uh, I'm planning on this being where the blood altar is going to go. Okay. I think this is big enough. It's like the inner hole, inner square is 17 by 17. Needs to be 19 by 19. Okay, well, the whole thing is 19 by 19, so maybe okay. that, should be, that should be enough. Um, and then in here, I'm just going to put a bunch of the, uh, the, the blood. Okay. The blood stuff. Because it's all made out of undead wood. Nice. Because, <laughs> you know, it's, it's all the evil craft evilness is going to go in here. Hi. So now I just need to get it. Push. Get in there. <coughs> Ooh, get a forest there. queen. Get in Sweet there. Bees. No, get, get in there. There you go. Change color. Ha. Are you... Pushing a chameleon around. I made him stone. <laughs> And now he's trapped. I should call him Edgar. <laughs> if you're not familiar. <coughs> Max boyfriend? Is your familiar? Alright. What? What? Who? My high school huh? boyfriend. His name was Edgar. <laughs> oh. I had no idea. Yep. Mm. Let's put that in there. Uh, Alrighty then. Alright, so, All right, so I here. found the spirit entrance, but it won't let me in here. Spirit entrance? Yeah. So, um, I made it all the way down into the knights thing, and once I got to the to where they are, it's 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 stopping me from going in. Um Yeah, so that's dumb. Okay, hold on a second. You're in the Twilight Forest, right? Yep. Okay. Uh so I'm is not that the, is is it like the barrier of um yeah of that place yeah it looks kind of like it it is the whole rest of the place is open for me it might not be open for you oh yeah i'm blind yeah there's no squiggles here where i am standing but once i get to here squiggles so yeah this twilight forest is weird because i'm not it's almost like it's not going in order for me. And I don't know why. Hmm. Because I can't go to the Hydra. I've beaten the Snow Queen. I've beaten the Naga. I've beaten the Lynch. Um, I'm trying to find the, the Mushroom Cowboy guys. And that's been a no-go. Weird. Yeah. Uh... There's the Naga Maze. The Dark Forest. Okay. The north of here mm -hmm. is... It looks like the Lich area. Mm-hmm. Okay, there's the Ice Biome with the Yeti. I did the Yeti already. Okay. Um, there's the Troll Zone. Just before all of the brambles. Yep, I've been there. Hmm. Yeah, because yeah, your progression I... should be that should be pretty, that's basically it. It's basically yeah. following the. Uh, uh, where is that? Twilight Forest progression here. Uh, spider and hedge maze, Naga slain. Uh, get the lich, kill that. Get stroke, kill the. Hydra, Urgast, and Snow Queen. Yeah, I already did the Snow Queen. Uh, Meef Stroganoff should get you. You see, then you kill the 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 mushroom. Yeah, I need the, to find the minotaur. Them. The minotaur. Minus room, whatever his name is, uh, to get so you can get to the fire swamp to kill the Hydra. Yeah. All right. Let me and find. Let me find the mushroom guy. Yeah. 
There's always a there's always a minus room at the at the bottom of every one of those mazes. Yep. So yes, it's not a you know at least it's not a, like a random chance of it spawning without the minus room. It's, oh yeah, would, no, it's just that would finding suck. it though. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> right there. Okay. Oh, but it's see. usually in like savan like uh, twilight savannas. Yeah, I found one. I just have to get to it. Uh, it looks like my spider hedge is the closest. Yeah. All right. It should be this way. Put <laughs> all that away. I got dark gems. Um, where did I put? Ah, there it is. No, that's a enchantment table. Uh... Did I not make the blood altar yet? I don't think I made the blood altar yet. Is it part of a quest? No, I made it. I need to keep going this way. Then where did I put it? Uh, I'm not sure. Where is it? Ah, there it is. Got it. How high up does the blood altar need to be for a fully constructed thing? Mm, um, six? Like four blocks? No, it's six. It's like six. Five or six. Okay, let's check to see. Tier six, I think, is the maximum size. Yeah, Image. six is the l largest. Because it goes altar, and then one block, and then two, and then two, and then three, and three. <coughs> altar, one, yeah. One, two, three. Alright, I want to see something real Four. quick. I'm going to go into game mode just so that I can Six. look at this thing. Okay. So I'm going to need a whole lot of stone, I think. Alright, that's that. Is this the giant? I think this is the giant I'll use slate. Thing. I'll use slate for now. Yes. Okay, that's the giant one. I can't get to that one yet, though. So in the center of this thing, which should be about... Uh, I want to get in two, there, three, but I can't. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Alright, I'm just flying to find it now. <laughs> oh, it's 17 short. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 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 in the middle. Are you trying to figure out the dimensions? Two, three, four, five. Uh, I think I have the dimensions down. I just need to, uh, get this thing in place. Okay. I think that's high enough. Alright, so it should be 23 by 23 by 9. 23 by 23 by 9. Well, 9 is the highest for the pillars on 6. Okay. That's where the that's where the altar's gonna be sitting when it's all said and done. Holy cow! Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, so it's twenty-two by twenty-two by nine. Then I'm gonna move this thing back a bit, I think. Yeah. Uh, so maybe I'll just plan for I guess tier three should be enough. That's just up by one. Two blocks, actually. All right, that's the ice queen. Already been there. That's the yeti. I've already been there. Like that. And I have my waypoints all so I can see where I've been. Alright, this should be tier, th technically uh, speaking, this should make eventually become a tier 3. So, I just need to have, have the blood altar there, that's all good. Uh, so, for the magic part, um, 
A bowl of empty promises. What is it used for? A filled bowl of empty promises. <laughs> yep. Uh. Oh. Huh. So if you take blood and infuse it into a bowl of empty promises, you get a bowl of promises. Strength zero. Okay. Which is needed to make the machine a machine tier upgrade. I found it finally. Oh, really? Oh! <laughs> Server crashed. What happened? I, d I found the mushroom thing. I don't know. <laughs> what happened? Apparently it did not like me finding it. That's why I couldn't find it before. The server wasn't uh, letting me. How dare it? <laughs> That's so not nice. Uh, okay, it's all loading up. Huh, man. <clears throat> I gotta love it when, when mod packs decide to just randomly crash for no reason. <laughs> It didn't, I t I'm telling you, it did not want me to progress. It was like, oh, she's getting too close. Java is a very finicky language, I found. <laughs> What's really funny, so Java behaves like this, C++ behaves like this, mm -hmm. C Sharp behaves like this. Surprisingly enough, I gotta hand it to Apple, they make a pretty strong language. If they? this thing was programmed in Objective-C... We wouldn't be getting crashes like this. It would throw yeah. errors with the wazoo, but it, but wouldn't, it wouldn't crash. crash. Yeah, um, so. RW is learning Java right now. Yeah, it is. <clears throat> it is finicky, finicky, finicky. Java is pretty powerful, though. It's very good with a lot of stuff. And it's obviously extremely portable. As, as they say, as they like to say in their <laughs> installer windows. Everything runs on Java. Mm-hmm. I'm like, well, yeah, if you pump enough coffee into people, then yeah, of course <laughs> it runs on Java. <sighs> Come on. Stop throwing it's an old at me. It's almost there. No. Modi and I told RW that uh, he needs to learn it so he can start making mod packs. And then him <laughs> and Tegan can work together. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That that should be kind of fun. I'd like to see that. He, he learns to make the mods <coughs> and then she puts them all in a pack. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Da, 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 da. Parsing ah. errors. Commands are finally up. Alright, I'm logging in, so let's see if this works. Enjoy the game. All right. I'm here. Labyrinth chunk. Can't keep up. Another labyrinth found. <coughs> I have joined. Yay. Heather's been survived. Yes. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> back to what now, we were doing. Back, back to our previously scheduled <laughs> game, gameplay. Uh... <coughs> Oh, mushroom guy, you scared me. So, put some pants on, dude. It leads eventually to some machine upgrades, it looks like. Which I find kind of weird, but, you know, whatever. Um, oh, right. am I? Wait. Oh, come on. Why do they all have to be infernal? This sucks so much. Oh, no. You're fighting infernal bad guys. Yes. Oof. Give me some methane. All right. Methane. Let me grab this water. From all the hummus. I'm going to need it. Okay. Speaking of hummus, I need to find a good low cal thing to dip into some hummus. 
I want to start eating hummus more. Hummus is I know good. It's, you know, it's good for you. It is. And I, I kind of like the Sabra stuff. Yeah, with the, like, the, the, the bit of, you know, uh, garlic stuff on what top. What the? Garlic herb hummus. <clears throat> I'd like to do that. What, what is going on? I'm not sure to dip it. Oh, okay. All right. Broccoli? You kind of nice? Celery, perhaps? <coughs> Cucumber. 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 Slices of cucumber and hummus are amazing. Cucumber slices and hummus. Like strips. Yeah, or strips? even chips. Even chips like uh, cucumber, cucumber chips. chips. Like just, just cucumber slices? Like yeah. Just cores? I mean, I've done oh. the long ones, kind of like a pickle spear, but it's a cucumber. Right. But uh, you could do chips, too. And then you could make your body think you're eating like regular chips. Oh, well, there you go. Mm -mm. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Yeah. Huh. I also find that cucumber doesn't like mask the taste of the hummus like a lot of things do. Yeah, I know celery is pretty strong. Yeah. It's, it used to be one of the strongest peppers are things too. To dip things in. Peppers. Green I'm not peppers. Not peppers. Even even green or bell. Yeah. I just don't like peppers. They're okay. I can only eat them in moderation. I can't eat like a bunch of them at a time. I get you. I get you. My bane is olives. Oh, I love olives. Ugh, olives are gross. Oh, bla little black olives. Oh my god, those are the best. I even love the grit, the the green Greek olives. No, nope, can't do olives. Oh my god, they're so good. They're so good. Just pop them and go crazy on them. Stop shooting me, stupid slime bug. Yeah, here. I think I'm gonna need to come back and get more torches, unless I can find a. A torch torch room. Bush. No, a torch room. Oh, a torch room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Peacock feather fan. What does that do again? No, oh, it's just there. Okay. Neat. It's so dark. Ugh. Oh, hi, regular spider. You're weird in here. What is a regular spider doing in there? I don't know. Hey, I'm just doing spider things. Yep. <clears throat> oh yes, the sacrificial knife. Okay, so I need three dark gems, three gold ingots, two iron ingots, a golden sword, and some sticks. Oh wait, is this a torch room in here? So two sticks. Uh, nope, it only has two. <laughs> okay. Three gold ingots. Two iron ingots. Oh, I see you. Uh, ooh, a gold sword. Uh, five and some wood. Oh, is this a? Oh, hi. And then dark gems. No, oh, not oh, even. Not a dark gems. Uh -huh. mm. Oh no! You don't have any more? I, no, I'm all out. All oh. right, let's see how fast we can get this <coughs> chest before it explodes. Well, at least I'll make, I'll make the gold sword while I'm here. All right. uh, First, let's oh, it's do this. blacksmithing, isn't it? Of course it is. Of course it is. Blacksmithing. I don't care about that. Is that? Or those. Use this. All right, here we go. Oh, it's in, the, it's in the mining shed. There you go. Oh, it didn't explode. Cool. Okay. So the sword looks like that. There, golden sword. Perfect. So now I'll go down into the mines and see if I can pick up some dark dark gem. Oh, there's Between one. 25 and 55. Oh, no, prosperity. All right, let's do this. What does this book say? Um, yeah, I don't care about that. All right. Torches, sweet torches. Those and that. I don't care about that. Oh, when did I get cookies? Nice. Oh, when you kill infernal mobs. Oh, that's kind of cool. They drop cookies. A little weird, but you know. 
What is that? There you go. Dark gem. Once oh, get that. the trip wire. Huh. One. Not falling <coughs> for that. <laughs> I have one torch left. I need to find a torch room quick. Stupid creepers. Um, that was the torch thing. Okay. <clears throat> now. Uh, dark gem more. Is there any more out here? Oh, hi. I see you. Ow, stop oh, picking me up. Oh. Stop picking Creepers. me up. Stop. Oh, God. Okay. Stop. Jeez. Right, I came from that way. Let's go this... Nope, this is water. All right. Go away! I should have grabbed cobble. <coughs> so I knew which way I went. Uh, yes. That's always a good idea. Yeah. Place down a trail of breadcrumbs with cobblestone. I always just, if I get to a dead end, I just uh, block off the entrance from where I came from. That always works out. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, Let's do this. I'm gonna put two there so we know. Let's go back to the port. Well, let me let me mark this first. I um, think that that spider had a jockey on it. I see a spider just standing there with a bunch <laughs> of bones and some dust around it. That. Hmm. All right, we're gonna come in. And it was here. in a small area that the spider could get to, but a skeleton could not. Oh, he lost his friend. Heh, <laughs> Alright, we're gonna grab cobble and torches. <coughs> okay. I got one dark gem. Mm. So I got enough to make my thing now. What is that? It's Skeleton Warrior. It's an infernal skeleton warrior. Oh god. Mm -hmm. There's two of them. They're bad. I'm cornered. I'm dead. Oh. And let's see. I'm alive. Um. Okay. Yeah, we'll use this. Uh, sacrificial knife. So, it was three dark gems, and then that, this, and then three of those. Two of that, two sticks, and the golden sword. It's a sacrificial dagger. Alright. All right. So we'll take these. And we'll block that. So we'll put all this over here. Okay. And then this actually just goes to where we were as well. So let's do this. Okay. Okay. Um, oh, okay, that's a dead end. Is life essence passively draining? Is what? Huh. I um I'm not entirely sure what's going on, but it looks like uh life essence is gradually draining out of the blood altar. Weird. There's nothing in it. Okay. Is there anything under it? it? Uh, just... I just put some slate to hold it up. Hmm. It's standard rustic slate. It's not like the... the um, blood magic to, uh, slate blocks or anything like that. Weird. Yeah, it's just draining. I just I put in two buckets worth of lava, of uh, blood, and now it's down to 1.4 buckets. That's weird. Uh, it seems to have stopped draining. Hmm. Are you sure nothing fell into it? Uh. I mean, the only thing I could think of was I accidentally put my sword on it, but that's not draining anything. I took the sword immediately off. Hmm. That's weird. 
I planted a torch on top that broke it, but the, the um, there's that mod that immediately puts things in your inventory when you break yeah. something. So it didn't fall into it. Weird. Uh, I guess it's just some some weird quirk. Something is going on. Maybe there's like, maybe it was like gradually filling my personal blood network. Maybe. Oh, do you have one? <clears throat> I mean, there's a little red bar on the bottom right of my screen. Then yes. But it's not full. It's like almost full. I do have two blood extractors on me, which are both full of blood, and they have been. I don't know. Something weird. I'm strain mysteriously losing blood. Hmm. That sounds like a really bad problem to have. <laughs> So, well, you know what? We're way over time. Oh, we are. Can you believe that? It's ridiculous. <laughs> Stupid server restart. Uh, anyways, guys, I want to thank you all for joining us for this episode of DDSS. Myself and Heather. Thank if you, you are new to either of our channels, the subscribe button, leave a like, leave a comment, loves you, that kind of thing. As always, I want to give a huge shout out to our sponsors, Host Havoc. If you're looking for quality Minecraft servers and more, go check out Host Havoc in the description down below. Be sure to use the reference link to so you know who has the absolute best fans. It's clearly us. Mm-hmm. And uh, if you want to help out and uh, help us make more and better content, be sure to check out our Patreon offerings. We have a, a bunch of Minecraft servers to play on. Have it got beaten up by a slime beetle. Yep. Um, we also have a squad Discord for all our patrons to hang out on. It's a lot of fun. And uh, if you want to help support us, then go check that out. It would be super cool of you. Uh, so once again, guys, thank you for joining us, and we will see you next time. Bye, guys. Bye-bye.